Croatia have just one thing on their minds, and that is to ensure that that coveted place in the knockout stages is theirs after 90 minutes. They have the luxury of knowing it is in their own hands. Three points would be plenty to see them through. However, anything less than that, and it could become precarious. Look on the faces of the players, nothing but utterly focused. They know what they have to do. A big performance now will count. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue. Quite a sight to behold. Croatia are utterly focused and determined. They know how much this means. Well, Peter, the, the question that comes to mind is how much do they want it? These players know that this could be the gateway for, for bigger things. Progression for starters brings greater financial reward. It increases the brand power and can enhance the whole business side of things. Individual player profile elevation is also a huge incentive. Careers can be catapulted from this. It's worth remembering. You're just joining us, we are already on the way. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? The exciting Ivan Perisic. Uh, tall and rangy, but he has a deft touch and enough pace to move clear of attention. And he's always looking to shift the ball onto that left foot too, and he packs real power with it. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. Chaleta Shah. Vida. It's the through ball, cut out in the nick of time. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Chaleta Shah switches it towards the other side. Come back to the keeper. Up towards the front line. Brozovic battles to win it back. Vlasic looking to get within range. Well, that's where he wants it. Chaleta Shah positions himself well and cuts it out. Whipped in. Defending of the desperate variety. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. Looks to bypass the midfield. Chaleta Shah. Vlasic. Rimic! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Rimic simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Shelko. Neither side yet able to find the net. Vida. Croatia have to win if they're to make it. And it's Modric. Had a shot! And that's off target. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong may come right. Kaderbeck. Forward it goes. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Rebic, out towards the flank. What an adventurous run from a defender. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Modric goes short. 
A heavy challenge. No complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. Well played, he saw that coming. Modric. Vlasic. Schick. Just five minutes left until the break. That's been drilled forward. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Tries to locate someone up front. It's a long ball, and it's not hit its target. Vlasic. Modric plays it forward. And we hit half-time, so the other team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Yeah, the scoreline doesn't tell the whole story as one side has been significantly better, at least offensively. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil there. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Croatia playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline. Converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Modric. And it's Brozovic. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. But even out to the right. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Chaleta Shah. Perisic. Lovely bit of skill there. Time to deliver. Plays it back. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Vida. Brozovic. Almost an hour gone. Nil-nil the score, and we're just about done. A deeply frustrating game. Schick, and now they can launch a counter. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And it's played forward. Plays it out to the wing. Oh, gr has a pop! Brozovic. Michelko. Vida. Brozovic. Michelko. Looking cross field, changing the point of attack. That's alert and sharp and very well played. And it's Perisic. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Played in with accuracy. Played towards the front men. Oh, good interception. Drives it towards the front. Schick, out to the left it goes, delivers a cross. The Czech Republic showing a good level of intensity at this stage, they're calling on all their resources now.
Modric tries to get it forward quickly. Suchi hoists it forward. Vida gets it away. And it's played forward. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Done very well to intervene. Vida. Still no sign of a breakthrough. I'm just quite a surprise if you consider the gulf in quality between the two teams. Vida. Chaleta Shah. And it's for Selko. He's picked him out. And that has been cleared. You wonder if that's it now, but... Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Well, it looked nil-nil from a fair way out. A little craft or guile or penetration. Defences largely untroubled. It's goalless. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? A rather flat performance for me when we expected something a lot stronger. I think they thought the win would just come to them, and it didn't.